Just a final note on the salinity refractometer. Uh, this device is used to measure the amount of salt in your tank. Uh, do not be intimidated by it all. It looks like this really complicated um, lab device. It's actually extremely easy to use and um, it's much more accurate than a hydrometer. So uh, I highly recommend getting one of these. If you actually follow your instructions on when mixing your synthetic salt water, uh, your, your gravity should be already good. Uh, you'd want to look at your salinity parameters if there's a lot of evaporation coming from your tank. So that's when you really want to pay attention to that. And again, if your gravity is getting a little too high, you want to add fresh RODI water to the tank. Um, I don't think you have a big problem with the Oceanic BioCube because uh, the cover is usually on. So, But it just depends on what climate you are in uh, when you're setting it up. If you're in a warmer climate, you're obviously going to have more evaporation. So you're going to have want to watch uh, your salinity parameter. As long as you do your weekly water changes, you should not have that much of a problem with uh, the salt in your tank, but it is something very important that a lot of people, uh, they tend to neglect over time. So you just want to measure it. And these are very inexpensive now on the internet. A refractometer, salinity refractometer.